Hey guys, it's Cuddle Death. We're back with another episode of Pokemon Ruby Yana. Why am I talking really fast? I have no idea. In the last episode, we started the game. We got Torchic, and by the way, um, since I accidentally didn't name him, I decided to start over, and he's officially Colonel Sanders. And if you don't know who Colonel Sanders is, um, hopefully you have a Kentucky Fried Chicken. That guy that's on the logo is Colonel Sanders. So what do you have to say, lady? Wild wow, Pokemon will jump out- Oh, I forgot to set the- the freaking the text feed. Wild wow, Pokemon will jump out at you in Tallgrass. If you want to catch Pokemon, you have to go into Tallgrass and search. Okay. So we're gonna go ahead and change our attack speed again, and probably change my mouth speed back to normal, perhaps. Okay. So, hopefully in this episode we kick Brendan's butt because he sucks. Um, here's our first victim. It's a worm pull. Okay. Go, Colonel Sanders! You got this. Okay. Oh god, it's using string shot. That's so annoying. Oh well. Don't you guys just hate that? Don't you guys hate screen shots? Oh well, whatever. Whatever. We're gonna get over it. Cause... That's all Wormpool's good for. No, I'm just kidding. Wormpool's are good for more than that. You're good for tackling too. Right there. You just did three damage to Colonel Sanders. That's not very nice, if I do say so myself. Now, um... <laughs> funny story. Particle Wee has really in- Particle Wee, really? That's his old name. Silversleeve has a really funny episode <laughs> whenever he went to fight his rival, May. So, I'm not gonna really spoil what happened, but like, you should definitely go check that out and then you'll, you'll be entertained really fast. So, I already forgot this, this city's name. It doesn't matter because we're at Route 103. We're gonna talk to this guy. Cause this guy has something to say. My Pokemon is staggeringly tired. I should have brought a potion. I have one if you want it. I'll give it to you. I don't care. I don't need it. I definitely don't need a potion. I'm too good for that. And here's our white-haired individual. Okay. So it's this one and that one that live on Route 103. Hey, it's Kristen. Ooh, you stalked me. Oh yeah, Dad gave you a Pokemon. Since we're here, how about a little battle? I'll teach you what being a trainer is about. Oh god. I honestly, I hate his theme song. I really honestly hate this that rival theme song. It's so stupid. And he has a mud kit because he likes them. He you didn't hear that he likes them. He definitely does like them. So Scratch barely does any damage. We're gonna go ahead and toss up a growl. Probably gonna use two growls. Because we like to be strategic. Yeah, we're gonna use another growl. Because we're only level five. And it wouldn't be cool to get hurt really bad. Yep, okay. So we've got this battle now. Two growls. It's good to be safe. I think I won't get a crit. <laughs> okay. By the way, just random talk here. If you guys have a Steam account, um, the Steam forums, were, Steam forums excuse me, were hacked recently. So these Steam forums were hacked recently. And apparently there was a, a security breach which credit card information might have been compromised so it is wise to change your password on Steam. Just letting you guys know. So Colonel Sanders, Sanders, really? Sanders had no problem <laughs> feeding that mudkip. Huh? Kristen, you're not too shabby. Also, Colonel Sanders leveled up. I think I get it. I think I know why my dad has his eye out for you now. Look, your Pokemon already likes you, even though you just got it. Kristen, I get the feeling that you could befriend any Pokemon with ease. We should head back to the lab. Okay, so he's telling me what to do. Whatever, we're gonna follow in his footsteps, because we have to... We're gonna go back to the lab and see what's going on there because he said that we- he thinks that we should get back to the lab, so whatever! And he's waiting for me. I'm heading back to my dad's lab- you just said that! Kristen, you should hustle back too. Um, there's no hustling whenever I can't run. Hello? And he walks faster than me, he's a really fast walker. He's one of those, um, power walkers that you see in the mall. Actually, I, I walk kind of fast too. Even though I'm short, I'm like five foot two. Don't make fun of me. I still love you guys. Okay. We're in the lab. Oh, hi, Kristen. I heard you beat Brendan on your first try. That's excellent. Brendan's helping, been helping me with my research for a long time. Brendan has an extensive history as a trainer already. Here, Kristen, I ordered this for my research, but I think you should have this Pokédex. I received the Pokédex. The Pokédex is a high-tech tool that automatically makes a record of any Pokémon you meet or catch. My kid, Brendan, goes everywhere with it. Whenever my kid, I'm gonna seriously read this like this. My kid, Brendan, goes everywhere with it. Whenever my kid catches a rare Pokemon and records its data in the Pokedex, why, Brendan licks- what? Brendan licks for me while I'm out doing field work and shows me. Their English is so weird in here. Huh, so you get a Pokedex too. 
Well, then here, I'll give you this. So we got the Pokeball. <laughs> we got the Pokeball. It's not- it's- it's the one. You know it's more fun to have a whole bunch of Pokemon. I'm going to explore all over the place and find different Pokemon. If I find any cool Pokemon, you bet I'll try to catch them with my balls. Okay. I like how he says he's gonna go catch them, then he just stands there like an idiot. So we are still, well, we're back in Little Root Town, and our mom's waiting there for us. And I tried to leave without her, but no, she spotted me. Crap. Wait, Kristen. Kristen, Kristen, did you introduce yourself to Professor Birch? Oh, what an adorable Pokemon! You got it from Professor Birch. How nice. Hell yeah, that's Colonel Sanders. You and you're, yeah, you're your father's child. You're your father's child. All right. You look good together with Pokemon. Here, honey. If you're going to go out on an adventure, wear these running shoes. They'll put a zip in your step. Because my step needs more zipping. Chris, and those shoes came with instructions. Press B while wearing these running shoes to run extra fast. Slip on these running shoes and race in the great outdoors. To think that you have your very own Pokemon now. Your father will be overjoyed. But please be careful. If anything happens, you can come home. Go on. Go get them, honey. Interesting stuff, Mom, but we don't care. We're gonna run back out on Route 101. Hey, Pokemon! Look out! Oh, shit! We ran into something. What is it? What could it possibly be? Oh my god, it's a Zigzagoon. That is by far, like, one of the rarest Pokemon out there. And, oops, I forgot the yellow Colonel Sanders. Um... You know what? He growled at me. I'm gonna run, because I don't have faith in Colonel Sanders right now. Not with his HP. Um... Another battle, really? It's that- it's that goddamn Zigzagoon again. Um... We'll see if he growls. If he growls, I'm just gonna say, fuck it. Oh my god, fuck this. Okay, you know what? We're gonna use our potion. Actually, I could use it in the battle, but I'm too scared. I'm a wimp. Okay, Colonel Sanders is fine. And I- you know, the Poke- Pokemart, that's what I was gonna say. The Pokemon Center is like, a few steps away. If it is a Zigzagoon, I swear to god, it is a Zigzagoon, I'm gonna catch it. <laughs> That's what I was gonna say. Unless I kill it. Colonel Sanders! Okay, good. Growl is perfect, because that means I won't kill it. Unless I crit. Don't crit, Colonel Sanders. I have faith in you. Good. Okay, so... Gonna catch the Zigzagoon. I have the perfect name for it that I'm stealing from my boyfriend. <laughs> Cause he has one of these too. Okay. Oh, I thought we weren't gonna catch it, that was scary. Okay. So, Zigzagoon's data was added to the Pokédex. He's a tiny raccoon Pokémon, stands 1 foot 4 inches, 38 pounds? He's a fatty! Zigzagoon restlessly wanders everywhere at all times. This Pokémon does so it, because it is very curious. It becomes interested in anything that happens to see. Give a nickname to the captured Zigzagoon? Yes, I will. I'm gonna name... Her S T I C K Y, which is the exact same name that Silver Sleep gave to his Zigzagoon. Because hopefully this one has the ability to pick up, and if it doesn't, I'm gonna have bad luck. Oh, it does. Perfect. I forgot if they have Runaway in this as well, but I was afraid of that. Okay, so we are back in Old Dale Town, where there's an old man there. But we're gonna keep keep moving. Because we like to keep moving. But we're not going to get that much further. But we did heal our Pokemon, which is always good news. Good news for us. News? News. Okay, we're heading to Route 102. And we're walking in the grass, kicking some grass. And it's another Zigzagoon. Colonel Sanders needs some experience. So experience he shall receive after getting a crit. That's awesome. Colonel Sanders is so cool. And I know that you guys can agree. I'd almost catch this Zigzagoon again, but you know what? I'm not gonna. I don't need to. I should- you know what? I should just have a team full of Zigzagoons. That'd be really funny. Oh, Colonel Sanders learned focus energy. Now he can be a focused little chicken. Okay then. Run! <gasps> Oh my goodness. If you have Pokemon with you, then you're an official Pokemon trainer. You can't say no to my challenge. I know I can't, but I would if I could, but Nintendo programmed me not- Actually, they programmed me in the game to not be able to say no. But he has a wretched Zigzagoon. 
We're so scared of those. We're gonna use focus energy because we want to crit. It'd be really funny if we get one. Colonel Sanders is getting pumped. Oh god, of course Zigzagoon would use Growl. Why did I do that? Whatever. Get a crit. Nope. That's not gonna work, Colonel Sanders. Don't make me get out sticky. Actually, I forgot if um, Silver sleeps sticky as a girl or a boy. We'll find out. I'll have to check. It's probably a boy because... yeah. Oh, we got our crit! There you go, Colonel Sanders. There you go. Whatever. There! That Zigzagoon's down. 63 experience and we leveled. Colonel Sanders is now level 8. That's my boy. Arg! I lost! I should have trained mine more. Hooray! Okay. And then there's a bug catcher. We're just basically gonna finish these dudes up on this route. Ha ha ha! Alright, Zmet, I'll take you on with my bug Pokemon! I'll take you on with my Colonel Sanders. Actually, I should take you on with Sticky, but I'm taking you on with Colonel Sanders for now. So, there. Colonel Sanders is here. We're gonna use Focus Energy again because he has a few Pokemon. And I wouldn't mind getting a crit. And of course, Wormpulse can be a string shot. But I don't think Colonel Sanders is gonna be slow enough just yet. Maybe he'll be. Nope. Just as I expected, he's still faster. Usually I wouldn't use Focus Energy, but I decided to make this a little bit more exciting. I don't know. Because I am not a very exciting person to watch. Actually, I hope I am, but... <laughs> you never know. Okay, Colonel Sanders. Almost level 9. This dude's got another Wormpool. Actually, I thought he had more Wormpools than that, but I'm stupid and decided to go for Focus Energy. But maybe Colonel Sandals... Sandals. I keep... I call them Sand... What did I call him earlier? Sandards or something? And then now I just call him Colonel Sandals. His name keeps changing. <laughs> Colonel Sanders. There. Oh, he got a critical. Yeah, right whenever it was in the red. That's exactly what we needed. Good job, Colonel Sanders. Ow! Down and out! Oh, Sucks for him. Okay, this little kid doesn't battle me. And then there's this last trainer. Did you just become a trainer? We're both beginners. Yay. Yay, yay, hooray, happy day. That's all I gotta say. Youngster Allen. He's got a Puccina. We got a Colonel Sanders. Um, I'm just gonna scratch the shit out of this Puccina. Oh my god. One shot, critical hit. Oh, wow. Holy shit. Colonel Sanders is level 9. He's got a tail low now. Colonel Sanders is the better bird. Because he makes the best chicken. Level 3. Oh yeah, like that growl's gonna do anything now. Watch, watch now that I said that, it's, it's gonna leave it with 1 HP despite me. Nope! Colonel Sanders is like, really kick ass. Okay, Young Stalin has been defeated. I called you because I thought I could beat you. Okay, sucks for you. Okay, so I want to get these berries really fast. But right here, there are two orange berries. Do you want to pick them? Yes, I do, actually. Why would you ask me? I walked up to it for a reason. I didn't want to look at it. Whatever. So we got orange berries and a petra berry. Or a petra. Two petra berries. Petra berries cure poison and orange berries restore 10 HP. You can feed them to your Pokemon whenever. But if you give them to your Pokemon... Actually, there's another trainer here. If you give them to your Pokemon, they will restore 10 HP whenever your Pokemon is in critical condition. I'm going to keep winning and aim to be the best trainer. Help me further my career. Okay, okay, lady. Lassie? It is Lass. Lastiana. That sounds like one word. Lastiana? Not Lastiana. Okay. Colonel Sanders is so cool. Everyone should, like, love Colonel Sanders. Maybe you don't like Torchic, but you gotta love Colonel Sanders. You gotta give it up to the man for making good chicken. Oh my god, Colonel Sanders is about to- I almost said evolve, but Colonel Sanders is about to level up again. I'm just going crazy. I don't know, I'm everywhere. I'm everywhere that no one else is. I probably got you guys so lost. And that Zigzagoon just growled at me, which means he's gonna live unless Colonel Sanders is cool and gets a crit. And he did it! And the little bastard growled at me again. He's gonna die, it's okay. Because Pokemon die, at least in my LPs, they die. They never come back. Colonel Sanders is now level 10 because he's just that cool and he learned Ember. Yay for Colonel Sanders. I ended up furthering your career. I know you did, because I am so good. 
There's an item down here. It is a potion. Yay. It was really laggy to me. The game wasn't, but I was. And there's a wormpole. You know what I'm gonna do to this wormpole? I hate it so much. I'm gonna take my Colonel Sanders and fry the fuck out of it. <laughs> Cause that's what he does with his chicken. Bye, wormpole. Okay. So we are oh, oh my god! I just got interrupted by a zigzagoon. <gasps> no! How dare you interrupt me while I was recording and talking. That's what you get. You get fried too. Colonel Sanders will fry anyone that stands in his way. Oh, I forgot I can run. Okay, so we are in Petalburg City, which is where I'm going to be cutting off this episode. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode. I'll see you guys in the next episode. I love you guys so much. Make sure to check out Silver Suit's corresponding part. It will be an annotation and a video response and in the description. I love you guys so much. Thank you guys so much for watching. Bye!